Hi, I'm Dr. William Lee. I'm a physician, scientist, and author, and I get lots of questions about COVID-19. And today I'm gonna to answer a few about antibody tests for the virus. I'd like to explain what an antibody test is and why they're so important. So here goes. What exactly are antibody tests and how do they work? Well, tests are being developed to identify people who have been infected by COVID-19, and there are different types of tests. One type of test looks for the virus itself by looking for its genetic material in your mucus. And this is the main kind of test that's used in medical centers uh, today, and it relies on a deep swab in your nose to capture a bit of that mucus. If you can find the genetic material of COVID-19 in the mucus, it's a positive test and you have the infection. If you can't find that genetic material, it's a negative test and it means you don't have COVID-19. This has been fairly reliable and it's used in most hospitals today. The other test is called an antibody test. Antibodies are naturally formed in the body after a virus infection. It's how your immune system recognizes a virus and special immune cells called B cells start pumping out antibodies that can stick to and mark the virus for destruction. So tests that detect antibodies show that your body has been exposed to and responded to the infection appropriately. And if you're somebody who's been sick and recovered and you can find antibodies in your bloodstream, that's a good sign because it means that you're likely to be resistant to reinfection and not gonna get sick again. Someone who actually has these antibodies might be safe to return to work in the future and they can commingle with other people, which is why these tests are ultimately gonna be so important. And here's an important point. It's absolutely crucial that all tests for COVID-19 are high quality, reliable, and accurate because we're gonna use these results to guide the identification of people who have been exposed and who have developed natural immunity. Here's another question. What are antibody tests used for in general? Well, antibody tests uh, are actually not used in general because when we give vaccines like the polio vaccine, tetanus vaccine, chickenpox vaccine, we don't use, we don't need antibody tests because well, we actually have enough experience with the vaccines so we know that they actually work. How are COVID-19 antibody tests conducted specifically? Well, antibodies circulate in the blood, so the COVID-19 antibody tests require a blood sample, and some of the tests just use a finger prick. Now, some of these antibody tests are available, but most of them still need to be validated, and that means that tests need to be done on the tests to make sure that they're accurate. How will COVID-19 antibody tests be effective in stopping the spread of the virus? Reliable antibody tests will allow doctors to figure out who has been infected and recovered and whose bodies contain these antibodies that make them more resistant to reinfection and they're not gonna get sick again. So someone who doesn't have antibodies probably hasn't been exposed or infected yet and is gonna be more vulnerable to getting infected and getting sick. And those are the people who are gonna obviously need a vaccine when it's available. Who should get a COVID-19 antibody test when they're made widely available? Well, in theory, everyone should get one because it'd be super helpful to know if you've ever been exposed and whether your body's making antibodies so you're safe to come into contact with another person who might carry the virus. And that's it for now. I hope I've helped clear up a few things about antibody tests for COVID-19. Stay safe.